Okay, I'm just going to do a quick video on my setup on uh, my hexacopter here. This is a Hobby King Turnigy H550 frame and I have six uh, NTM 28-26,000 kV uh, motors on it. The uh, receiver I have on here is the Futaba R615FS that goes along with my Futaba 7C. Um, I have for a controller, I have the Ardu Pilot 2.5 on here with uh, the U Blocks uh, G, uh, GPS unit attached. Um, and I'll go ahead and flip it over here. With that uh, controller, I get this power module that helps, uh, that goes between your battery and uh, the power distribution for your motors, and this powers the uh, APM 2.5. Let me just flip it over here. Okay, so what I got here is the um, Turnigy 5000 milliamp 3S battery. I've got six of these uh, speed controls. These are Turnigy Plus 30 amp um, speed controls. Uh, mounted on the bottom here, I have this uh, landing gear slash camera mount that uh, really just does a, um, a tilt. It doesn't do any pan. And it's a very simple uh, mount. Um, it's not that strong. If you have a, um, a tough landing, it'll definitely snap. Um, the only other thing I got on here right now, um, I just have a uh, simple uh, battery alarm on there. Okay, so the only thing that's different in this setup is that the arms that come with this uh, kit, it comes with three white and three red. I actually uh, painted this one um, red so that I could have two white ones up front. Other than that, it's a pretty, uh, pretty standard setup, and I'm just going to show a quick flight on how this, uh, how steady this helicopter flies. There we go. Connect my power wire here. Okay. So I am going to push up my stick here and arm. The controller. I'm not sure if you can see this, but on the controller, now I got a solid blue and a solid red. It means it's armed and the GPS is locked. Okay, let's go ahead and take it off. Gonna throw it in loiter mode here for a second so that you can see. Put this up here so you can see that how steady it's flying without me doing anything. Okay. cool thing is that I can actually see on the screen right here what my camera on the top of my head is looking at and I'm not sure I'm going to see my there's a little bit of a delay there obviously as you can see this is a good application for the GoPro app um, for the iPhone so I'm just going to pop my switch down here and go back into stabilize mode and I'm going to throw it into acro mode Very agile and acro mode. Whoa. <laughs>
I mean, that's not even in altitude hold mode. That's in stabilized mode. That's just in stabilized. I'm at seven minutes now, and uh, still flying pretty strong. I don't have much of a payload on here, but. Total flight time, you can see that is 12 minutes and 19 seconds. That's pretty good. I'm, uh, I'm pretty impressed with that. Okay, 12 minutes and 19 second flight time. Let's see what I got on my battery. Here, I want to check the cells. Okay, 48%. And the voltage was 